In this video, I'll show you how to add a signature to your Word document. If you found this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like. And let's get right into this guide. There are quite a few different ways for how you can go and add a signature to a Word document. One of them could be just writing it with your mouse, but the one I like to go and use is to actually just go and write it in person so I get exactly how my signature actually is. And then I can go and move it in to Word and I'm gonna show you exactly how to do that. So for this to work, you are gonna need a mobile device, but this can be any type of mobile device as long as it's got a connection to the internet and a camera. What you need to do is go and open up the camera app just like so and have your signature written on a piece of paper just like this. And all you need to do is then go and take a picture of this signature. Go and make the picture nice and well lit and also try and get quite close as well, but just make sure the photo is good quality. There we go, I've now gone and taken a photo. So now what we need to do is go and get this photo onto our computer. To do this, I recommend just emailing it to yourself because it's quite a small image or alternatively, you could use some form of cloud storage like Google Drive or Dropbox. And now here we are, I've now got the image on my computer. Personally, I went and emailed it to myself and then went and downloaded it onto my computer. Then what you need to do is go and drag it into your Word document like so, and there we go. Now, as you can see, you're probably thinking this looks awful. Don't worry, there's a lot of stuff we can go and do to this. Firstly, let's go and crop it. So go and tap on the image once and then go to the top and go and tap on image format. Then what you need to do is go over to the right hand side to where you go and see the option for crop, which is just here, tap on that there. And then we get these black lines and what we can do is go and crop down to what we want. So we can make this really precise because it's quite small what we want. So I'm gonna go and make it really close. Just to explain what I'm doing, all you need to do is go and click and hold and then move your mouse and then you can go and adjust it. It's really easy and yeah, that is perfect. So now that I've got that, you then want to go and tap on enter on your keyboard like so and it's gonna go and save your changes. Then what you want to do is make sure you've gone and clicked on the image again and make sure picture format is selected. Then what we can do is go and change the color of this so it fits in with the background of the document. To do that, just go to the top left and tap on color. And then what you can do is go and choose how you want the color to be. So in this case, we can go and use this recolor tool. And what I can do is go and use this black and white option. And that's it guys, we've now gone and got our signature. And if you want to be able to go and move it around more freely, all you need to do is right click on it and go down to wrap text and then just go and tap on tight. And there we go, you can now move it around wherever you want. And that's it, I can now go and save this document with my signature added. If you guys found this video useful, then please consider subscribing, peace.